Hey guys, so uh, if you watched a video I made with my friend Avo from a few weeks ago, uh, I was imaging Muro Fuchi with the Samyang 135mm lens and the Canon RA. And so in the video, I was using an Atlas EQG mount and I was using a, a dovetail and I had a, a drilled a hole in it for the uh, camera to be attached on it. So after seeing this, someone on Instagram uh, sent me a message about two days later and Wait. told me that it was uh, building, uh, you know. Like some custom stuff to make the, uh, the lens be like a telescope, essentially. Yeah, so you can actually put the lens on the dovetail right away and also attach some uh, accessories to it. So uh, it's all 3D printed and um, we it's got it today. super cool, yeah. So what we're gonna do now is we're going to open up the bag and we're gonna see, we're gonna see what's inside and check it out. Test Let's it see out. how it is. So we're gonna take this out. I have no idea what's in here. Uh, ooh. Oh, okay. Uh, okay, so we have these two pieces here. This one and this one. Very cool. And then we have these little red pieces. Very detailed. This one as well. And what we have here is a tiny dovetail, which I believe goes on the top, which is, I think, also 3D printed from what it feels like, very cool. Very, wow, so easy. And then we have these, uh, this <laughs> nice little Ziploc baggie. This is the strap for the focuser, and then here are some tiny little pieces that may have fallen out as well. The Astronetics manual can be found online. These are just five pages long and show how to assemble it on your lens. It is very simple to assemble and should take you less than 15 minutes. The last thing to do is to grab a spare dovetail and screw it on the rings. And once that's done, you can attach the dovetail actually to the bottom. Boop. And it just it goes on there. So this little gadget is really, really cute and very well put together. It's really nice, yeah. I like the red uh, and black combo here. So here we can put a focuser. Uh, so for example, the ZW EAF. Uh, right now, the one we have is on the mid 70. So I don't want to take it out. So I don't think we'll use this actually for, for this lens. We'll just use the uh, manual focus for now. And maybe down the line, if we uh, buy a Another focuser, we can just add it here. And what it does is it's going to wrap around this little red ring here and turn it automatically, which is pretty cool. Neat. And on top here, we have a uh, tiny like dovetail slash, not a dovetail, but like a, a shoe, a final shoe kind of for the um, for a, a guide scope. So yep. you can actually add this on top here. Just in. Yeah, <clears throat> just like that. And on the other side here, finally, you can actually add a uh, something like an ASI Air and um, that you can stick on here. So if you want, you can have like a full setup, like guide scope, ASI Air, and uh, focuser. So it's pretty cool. Like it looks like a, a full telescope. It's pretty crazy, uh, as you can see here. All right, guys. So this is uh, the finished uh, the finished product, product all together. Uh, of course, it's missing the ASI Air and the uh, yeah. focuser here, but yeah. um, it's all good here. Yeah, it's so really, really nice. It's beautiful. And of course, you know, red and black is always really like popular with uh, accessories. That's so true. this custom work is like really, really nice and well put together. So we'll have a link somewhere, uh, probably in the description below, uh, with where you can actually buy this. I think it will be available only on Agena Astro for now. Um, but I, I wouldn't be surprised if this goes uh, to different stores as well. So, yeah, it's, um, a really, it's a really neat piece of work. And I believe it's about 95 bucks, I believe. But yeah, it's really good if you have the lens. Uh, this is one of the best lenses for Astro, guys. So uh, if you have the same lens, which is the Samyang or the Rokinon uh, 135, this is uh, a great tool to have and I think it's fantastic. Yeah, I can't wait to put it out there to use. So I'm going to France for two months. So uh, once I come back, we'll do our best to make a video uh, of shooting with this uh, yeah, all together. So um, yeah, we'll see you guys next time and thanks guys. Yeah.